Starscream, how did you fail me for the last three years? Because you were dead and appear in the first generation line. But, but, Megatron, I wasn't there when you were released. I had to be hiding and chilling with other people. But, hey, at least I have a toy that's not late. Unlike you and your false Cybertron body. Uh, you're still talking about that thing. Let it go! I will never got that body. Unless they would have you to my this version and sew it in Asia, I will never know. But Megatron, you're Megatron, the evil leader of the Decepticons. You, in the near future, will create a big gigantic building and blow up the Autobot base. Who live in a canyon in the political Earth? <sighs> Do you predict the future? Did you? Did I mean that was gonna be sound like Wolverine? Oh crap. Yeah. Yeah. Hello, this is Spark Prime bringing you a review of the Transformers Generations Fall of Cybertron in Starscream. As you can see, Starscream is mostly in his traditional gray, red, and blue color scheme of poles of his thing. Next is Sepicon and Simeos. And he does fall down. Oh that. And he plus he's a coward so he can attack people. Very nice detail. And we have really nice detail and all that. And excuse me. And pretty nice. And yeah. Nice. Now for pictures, as I try to do some repairing things to do. After the night's repairing and picture taking, here he is. Now to transform him, first things first, take off these things, these cannons things, which you can, can combine to form. These Gatling guns, which you can show you in robot mode. But hey, very safe, sorry. But first things first, remove, put the canopy, the nose cone of the jet. Then, then you can flip up the arms. Then you can untab the feet and you can flip up this one so we can repeat the other side as you repeat and remove the feet the arm the rotating the race can clip together like so and then you can open up the arms like so and you can rotate it then open up everything rotate Rotate that. Then you can finally can put these by the tie underneath the buttocks. Then you can close these, form those things. Turn around and rotate the head. And lastly, there. Here he is. Starscream in robot mode. And now, for some screaming picture time. Here is Star Scream in Robo Mode. As you can see, he is pretty much detailed all through the way from the vehicle move convention. Very nice. Even the eyes are turned glow. Pretty nice. Detail. And yeah. As for these guns, you, as I show you, in the robot mode, you can put them as no ways. Pretty nice, but they can also combine, which I show you in the pre 
before he was transformed into a rubber moon. Let's show you. And yes, you can have him hold him like he's holding a big gigantic Gatling gun. But hey, it's Starscream. And while I keep dropping things, it's not so. Oh. Okay, my brother just done something stupid. But hey, that's why I stopped the camera before it. But anyway, for articulation, head can rotate 360 degrees, arms can rotate 360 degrees, arms rotate, bend double jointed. On rotating, no race articulation. Legs go forward, they go back, they rotate, bend one joint in the knee. They had a very side side motion, and yeah, he is pretty great. For size comparison, here he is next to his buddy, his great old friend, Megatron. Now you people warning, um, Sarge Reams a backstock backstabber, and Megatron does like backstabbers, so yeah, pretty much. Hey, uh, I'd say they're buddies. Come on, what a backstabber do? What a backstabber can do? Huh? Star Scream only appears in multiple series, and he did not see Megatron appears in multiple series, so why not? But hey, it's Megatron, so what? Let's see them, these buddies, in... in pictures. Holding hands, playing with jellyfish and all that other stuff. And see. Anyway, Starscream is a great addition to your Transformers collection if you play War Cybertron like I did. And you, pl and you play Fallout Cybertron, which I didn't. He is a nice addition to the game of your fans. And plus, if you want Megatron to be all lonely, but hey, it's Megatron's favorite buddy. And yes, however, all, the Dark Tommy is going to do a Skywolf version. Possibly in the near future, we might get one. Hope so. If not, we were stuck with Thundercracker. And we second are we sick and tired of Thundercracker? Hope not. But at least we can get all three seekers. And maybe a conehead be deco? Remjet perhaps? And Dirge? We don't know when French. And maybe a heavy heavy do we do as Slipsing. But or we do the other seekers who did period exits? Anyway, this is for Prime Scene Tier 10. Catch me on Twitter.com slash Spider Prime 2. Friend me, well, no, follow me on at also at Springform.com slash Spider Prime. Or let's follow me on DVR at Spider at Grimlock Megatron. And I show you means in art. And the next review, screw it. Screw it is now full cipher drum. It's a crayon. Or is it? See you next time.